no bailout extension for the cash-strapped Greeks has been revealed in the last hour and a possible default, therefore, now just a couple of days away. Let's cross live to a Felix Moreno, trader and portfolio manager at RF Trade, and get his thoughts on it. I guess uh, no great surprise here, I suppose. Um, a lot of people saw this coming. Uh, can, can Greece sensibly hold a referendum on the 5th of July? Then, I mean, What's it holding a referendum about if um, the Eurozone finance ministers have said, that's it, end of the line? Well, Kevin, if Greece is going to change direction and they're going to break with the EU or if they're going to have to default on their debt or any, any major decision of that type, uh, the Greek government is going to need to know that the public is behind them. Uh, mm. So they can hold the referendum on the latest proposal, which is being taken back by the EU, or they can hold the referendum on Greece's new direction, or they can do the first and mm, use it for the second Purpose. Interesting. What if the, uh, the Greek public come back and say, yeah, we'll go with it, we'll go with this plan? Is it too late? Do you think, is it really dead in the water? I think it's very unlikely that that would happen, but if it did, uh, the government of uh, Mr Tsipras would have to resign, and then we would have elections, and then we would have another few months of uh, uh, no, no possible deal, because, uh, because the, the, there's no government to negotiate with. So it's, uh, it's very difficult to see a deal being struck at this point. And there doesn't look like to be a particular plan B there, uh, keeping Greece uh, within the euro. Uh, so what is plan B now? Is it, is it Europe trying to ring-fence Greece? off uh, as, a, as a damage limitation exercise. What are they well, talking are about now? Because the Greeks have walked controls. out, haven't they? Well, if at the moment that the European Central Bank cuts off the emergency liquidity to Greek banks, we are going to see capital controls. And once they have capital controls and Greece is uh, ringed off, as you say, like, like what happened with Cyprus, uh, then the government of Greece is going to be very tender to the fault on the debt. Uh, and that, it's still, you know, it's a 420 billion euros. It's, uh, it's very tempting to just say, well, we're not going to pay. This debt is odious and uh, illegitimate. What happened to Angela Merkel's where there's a will, there's a way? We even heard some of those Eurozone ministers saying the same thing today, using that same phrase, where there's a will, there's a way. Is the will run out then, completely, you think? Uh, I think the will ran out uh, a few months ago, in January. Mm. Uh, they, they knew that they were going to face this crisis or a similar one uh, in the near future, this year, and they knew it was not going to be the last one because after Greece there's other countries on the spotlight. And, uh, and they wanted to set a precedent, they wanted to play bad cop to uh, give an example to any, any other potential debt uh, so, defaults. So cutting to the chase, as you see it so far, as it stands tonight, is it going to be a Grexit, yeah? I think that's the most probable scenario by... It's not inevitable, but I, I think uh, we're going to see it uh, within the next year. It's almost certain, in my opinion. OK, not sooner than that, you think? No, these things take time, and the euros that people hold in their hands as banknotes, mm -hmm. they've been going to the ATMs to withdraw, uh, they're going to still have value. I mean, they have value in Croatia, which uh, has its own currency. Why can't they have value in Greece, even if they uh, start to issue dragmas at the same time or in parallel? or they decide to abandon the euro, people are still going to use them. So these it, things take, take months. Interesting, too, those euro finance ministers uh, in a, 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 a press conference just earlier on were saying that, um, you know, it wasn't the end of the line as far as the Greek government's concerned. They're still liable for all these debts that they've run up. Are they going to be pursued? Yes, it's very then? tempting. It's very. They, they were using uh, the, liquid, the the emergency assistance and the bailout extensions to pay for the latest uh, tranches in the debt. So, mm. so they're going to they're going to be very tempted not to pay the IMF uh, at the end of the month. They're going to be tempted not to pay the next uh, the next few. Um, um, debt um, debt uh, settlements and and uh, after they do that a couple of times it becomes very tempting to reject all of the debt after all it's 175 percent of greek gdp so it's a lot of money mess isn't it felix thanks for your thoughts felix Merner, the trader and portfolio manager at rf trading